hosts order sufferers to experience. For those witnessing an episode, it's important to understand what catatonia is and how to respond to catatonic symptoms. Catatonia is a psychomotor disturbance since it involves psychiatric and physical or motor manifestations. It may be characterized by a marked decrease in, increase in, or peculiar motor activity. Mentally, its expression can range from unresponsiveness to agitation. Diagnosis and prevalence. Catatonic features occur most often in schizophrenia schizoaffective disorder, and similar conditions, but can occur with bipolar spectrum disorders and major depressive disorder. In some cases, catatonia may also be an extreme side effect of a medication or manifestation of another medical condition. There are no lab or clinical tests to diagnose catatonia. Instead, behavior rating scales are used. These include Bronid Catatonia Rating Scale, Bush Francis Catatonia Screening Instrument, Bush Francis Catatonia Rating Scale, Rogers Scale, Northrop Scale and Catatonia Rating Scale. Additionally, patients being screened for catatonia may be asked about their family medical history, have their vital signs checked, and be subject to a neurological exam. Types. Catatonia presents in two forms, one of excited delirium and one of stuporous behavior marked by unresponsive behavior that renders the sufferer mute, immobile, and responsive only to pain or visual stimuli. Symptoms. These are possible symptoms of catatonia, stupor, lack of response to external stimuli, e.g., no response to being spoken to or prodded catalepsy, muscular rigidity, so that the limbs remain in whatever position they are placed. Excessive motor activity with no purpose. Extreme negativism, resistance to movement or instruction. Mutism, being unable or unwilling to speak. Inappropriate postures and grimacing. Agilalia, parrot-like repetition of a word or phrase just spoken by another person. Echopraxia, repetitive imitation of the movements of another person. Treatment. There is no cure for catatonia, however, pharmaceuticals and electroconvulsive treatment act may be employed to treat symptoms of catatonia. Drugs such as benzodiazepines, muscle relaxants, antidepressants, and neuroleptics have all been used to treat catatonic symptoms. People who experience catatonic symptoms may also be admitted to psychiatric, medical, or neurological inpatient observation and treatment. Regular follow-up visits may be urged to stay ahead of catatonic episodes or to ensure readmittance is not warranted for the patient. In severe cases, catatonia patients may be placed in an intensive care unit ICU. The ICU might be suggested as a restrictive environment where the intravenous nutrition can be provided, as well as protecting the patient from self-injury and others from possible physical violence during the catatonic episode. If you are bipolar, be sure you educate your close friends.